All right, we're going to go through this big tub. I have no idea what's in here. Let's just look. It looks like a lot of it's going to end up being trash. That's not. All of that is. Uh-oh. Let's see if we can find what goes in that. Uncle Mike's sidekick. That would be nice. Looks like this purse has seen better days. Oh, no way. <laughs> What's going on guys? Jason Thrift Trader coming back to you with another video and today we're making some headway on the shop and uh, pulling out some stuff and going to uh, I'm making just little random piles and selling them on marketplace for 20 bucks a pile whatever and uh, I've got a couple people about to show up and dig through some of the stuff and uh, take what they want. Um, Anyways, uh, right now we're focused on the shop. We're trying to get it uh, more orderly, get rid of a lot of the stuff that really hasn't, doesn't really have much value, but will uh, will work good for somebody having a yard sale. And uh, going through a lot of stuff too, because there's plenty in this shop that we have never seen. Um, take a look at this. So really what I'm doing is this is all stuff that uh, is pretty much yard sale. Uh, I don't want to deal with it and uh, I've got them in lots here and I've posted them on Facebook marketplace and I've got some people coming to look at them and probably buy them $20 a lot is what I'm asking and uh, you know there's it's not phenomenal stuff but this thing's plumb full of books and uh, s some uh, kids mattresses here and this is just just random stuff and uh, Really, it's just stuff that I don't want. There's, I don't have any use for it. So that's how we're planning on getting rid of that stuff. So guess what? This came in the mail today. We're going to unbox it together. Take a look at this. Okay, so you guys have been on my case about this. And uh, so I broke down and ordered one. So let's see what we've got here. It would have been a lot easier if I had found... A way to open this prior but we're, we're working on it so I got two of these mainly because um, we're gonna need two of them for the auction take a look UB size here we go little unboxing here here's part of it Here's another part and another part. You guessed it. It's a tripod. Take a look at this. Yep, it's a tripod. I'm going to get this thing set up and I'll show you guys. So there you have it. There you have it. So what this is is a 10 inch ring light and uh, you just put power to it and you put your phone right there in the middle. You won't always have to use the ring light but it would be really good um, for darker places and um, it really just kind of projects light onto whatever you're filming. And you can put your phone like I said right there in the middle of the ring light and it would work perfectly. It also came with a really cool um, Bluetooth uh, remote so that you can start and stop your camera or your shutter and uh, that's really really neat this thing was forty dollars on Amazon and uh, we bought two of them I think it's a really good investment let's put it to use today alright so I have absolutely no idea what's in this bag and we're about to go through it it feels like it's probably books um, but who knows? Let's let's take a look. Could be good, could be bad. That looks like a book. The big black book. 
Um, okay. The book. Here's DVDs. VHS, maybe. Um, just a bunch of DVDs. Here's some VHS tapes. Another book. This looks like magazines, VHS, crossword, better homes and gardens, bunch of magazines, okay, paper, nothing of great importance there. There's more books and magazines. Paper products. More VHS tapes. More books. I think that's it for that bag. Oh, we got a purse. We've got a purse. Uh, it's empty. Not sure what the brand is. Um, made in China nice little purse and more magazines a bunch more magazines so that's what we had in there let's go through oh, let's go through this bag We got more clothing in here. Let's see what we've got here. This is an, uh, a vintage High Sierra uh, denim jacket. It's another jacket by Portrait. This is a leather jacket. Uh, license Italy AP don't know I'll have to look that up that right there could be something Maxima Wilson's leather it's kind of nice here's another Wilson's leather jacket right here and this one looks like a uh, a motorcycle jacket that's kind of nice uh, just a shirt another guy's shirt here oh. a pair of jeans uh, Land's End women's jeans that's it for that bag let's let's look in here I think this is probably going to be mostly trash looks like it um, but let's see what we might have uh, gross I'm not ooh there's something in there Nope, 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 nope. That looks like it's all trash to me. It's an old pepper shaker. Paperwork. 
that's rusted. Nothing in there. That's trash. That's trash. Yep, that box is plum trash. Alright, so here we have a signed little painting by California artist Franco. And uh, we don't believe that it's an original. Oh, Papa decided to show up. Say hi, Pops. Hi, Pops. Hi, Pops. <laughs> okay, three foot and uh, four inches, actually. Three foot four. Probably over four foot there. Frame to frame. Four foot, two inches. So it's about a three by four, give or take. Um, we saw uh, one similar going for around uh, $200 or so on eBay. Don't know how in the world I'm going to ship this thing if I do decide to sell it on eBay. That's going to be uh, quite the challenge. But it's on canvas, and it's uh, actually in really, really good shape. What I think is neat is how it's textured. Uh, although it's not an original, um, it is signed, and uh, it's a very beautiful piece. It's print on canvas and then embossed by the artist. Gotcha. Papa knows all. Pretty neat little piece. All right, random box. We're going to dig through this. Uh, these jeans are Rocky Mountain, they're vintage. I don't have any use for them, so I'll donate these. This says glass lantern chimneys. They look pretty old. Worth nothing, he said. Yeah. Uh, this will, these will go to donation oh boy yeah that's gonna be trash ew trash do you have it this is kind of neat it's hand blown Uh, it's in it. Yeah. Uh, looks like a couple feathers. So I'll set that in donation. What is that? That's some kind of a file thing. It's some kind of file. Your CDs, maybe. It's kind of junky. I think that'll probably be trash. What kind of rabbit? Oh, I just this thing's flopping around. Probably just the files. Yeah. Donation. Yeah. Trash. That's trash. That's Who trash. Save this crap. Why they put this in a storage? Oh, no. What's please say? Reed and Barton. I'm pretty certain that this is not. I bet this is not solid sterling. I don't have a clue what that is, but I don't need it. This. There's another bottle. Hand blown. You can tell because the bottom here is uneven. It says something. Anis Villain. Villena. V I L L E N A. Pretty nice. Little blue hand blown bottle. Oh, you might need that, huh? Put that on eBay for $40. Yeah, right. <laughs> House turds and everything. <laughs> What's this? Uh, what? Oh, it looks like it used to be a, yeah, it used to be a lighter. 
Kind of messed up now. Everything else pretty much junk, ain't it? Pretty much. Wait, what's this? Junk. Take a look. Hello, Calico. Bunch of trash. Bunch of trash. No kidding. Alright, we're going to go through this big tub. I have no idea what's in here. Let's just look. It looks like a lot of it's going to end up being trash. That's not... All of that is. Uh oh. Let's see if we can find what goes in that. Uncle Mike's sidekick. That'd be nice. Well. Looks like this purse has seen better days. Oh, no way. <laughs> Me. I'm not kidding. I am not kidding. I wish I was. Holy crap. Well, that's only half of one. What am I going to do with half of one? Buy the other half. Well, is that 50 cents? No. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, guys. Is that 50 cents? If you had the serial number, I think you could cash take it. Oh, wait. Here's the other half. There you go. Scotch Shoot. tape. Scotch tape. Here. You can have it if you want to tape it. Bro, I see a lot of scotch tape. <laughs> That's funny. Let's uh, let's count this out. There's a two. This is from 2003. Two, three, four, five, six, eight. This is from 1976. Ten, twelve. Uh, twelve dollars. Thirteen. <laughs> Nice. Well, well, keep looking. Keep looking, he said. How long you had that thing sitting there? For a while. I'm surprised that you haven't looked at it before. This one. Well, you know, there's there's times when my truck's full and I gotta empty it real fast, so I just throw it in here. Most of the time, that's how it goes. I understand that. <laughs> that uh, that bag's done for. We're still looking for what goes in there. That's just a cheap OT t-shirt. RS-232 cable. Wait. Plastic guitar ornament. There you go. Check that out. It's a lighter. That's what it is. Here's a drum to go with it. A drum? Nice. All right, this is going to be giveaway pile. Uh-oh. This is not good. Finish. Oh, it's not as bad as I thought. <laughs> what is it? That's a shell. It's a really nice shell. Pretty neat. Bad for shells. Huh? That's bad for shells. Birds, uh, what kind of box is this? Alaska salmon? Oh, okay. <laughs> Custom smoked Alaska salmon. Okay, so there's a lot of uh, quilting, quilting uh, pieces here. Okay. Now they all, they all, you put them in a box or something. I'll give that away. This is trash. I'll give this away. I'll get this away. That's trash. 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 Yeah, this fabric is pretty nice. Where do you want me to put it? This is all trash. Fabric, uh, yeah, just on that, on that um, cart, that wheelie cart. That's giveaway. Faberware. This, this is a oh, crap. 
this is a great brand guys revere wear um i'll have to set this to the side this is potentially good money on ebay if you ever if you ever run across this brand definitely look it up Um, this is a dashboard cover. Got the petty idea what it was for. Uh, it looks. I don't know. I dash don't topper. People don't use them much anymore. Well, yeah, I'll just give it away. Uh, this looks like it's going to be trash. This right here. This is all going to be trash right here. This stuff. I think that's a. Uh -oh. Get those out of the way. It's a nice little. Oh, there's the lamp it goes to, more than likely. Put this out there with. I'll give that away. Give that away too. I might want this basket. All things grow with love. That's nice. Give that away. That's broken. Whoa. Oh, dang. That's what. Yeah, that was a, just a candle holder. Cheap in it. I mean, it's just nothing. It's nothing to begin with. So you don't lose a whole lot. I'll give that away. Made in China, twenty nine ninety nine ninety nine. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Not that. No. Bless this looks like. Bless yeah. this house and all who in it. Yeah. That's nice. Everything else looks kind of junky. Yeah, right there. This dollar store. This old pulpery. Yeah. The rest of this is pretty much trash. Cool. And here we are going through this uh, bag of clothing. And uh, we found quite a few really good things in that storage unit. Unfortunately, it was one that I did not make a video on. But I have never been in this bag. This is all clothing that I really don't care about. But this thing just came out of there. And uh, this thing is... <laughs> really amazing check this out so anybody that doesn't know probably can't read that but it says east west musical instruments company and uh east west musical instruments is an amazing clothing brand um in the six late 60s early 70s they were manufactured um, by hand in uh san francisco california and uh really it, it catered to a lot of like the higher end, like the, the musicians of that era. For instance, even Elvis Presley uh, wore an East West Musical Instruments jacket. If you can recall, it was the silver leather jacket with the flames all over it. That was an East West jacket. I've only ran across um, one of these jackets once in my entire life. It was last year. Um, and it sold on eBay for over $800. And, uh, I don't know what style name this one is, but it's uh, it's a pretty magnificent find. I don't know if we're going to get 800 out of it. Uh, it depends on the style, but I'll have to do some more research and figure it out. Oh!